If you're looking for a software that helps you to build your business, gives you funnels, courses, emails, calendars, a CRM, social media, and so much more, then my favorite platform is definitely Go Higher Level. And we have a series of videos on this channel that teach you how to use Go Higher Level, and this is one of them. Welcome. If it is your first time watching any one of my videos, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. On this channel, I teach you how to turn your courses or coaching programs into a recurring revenue system in your business. So don't forget that if you are looking to give Go High Level a try, my link is right below this video. Please go ahead and click that and we have a bunch of amazing bonuses um, for you should you use my link. This quick tutorial will show you how to link your products in your funnels inside of Go High Level. Let's dive into creating products inside of Go High Level. So to create a product, all you need to do is to um, come into sites, of course, go into funnels, which we are already in, identify um, uh, the funnel. So the beautiful thing about this platform is that you can create your products all in one place and then link them later on. That means that you don't need to create products over and over and over again. You can simply link your products multiple times later on down the line. So um, if I'm creating a product for my summit funnel, for example, I'm going to click on my summit funnel over here and then I'm going to pick on uh, a step so the first step to pick on let's uh, pick on this uh, fast action bonus step over here what I want to do is go over here to the right hand side and click on products once you click on products depending on how new your account is it would probably be empty over here what you want to do is click on add product over here and instead of clicking into these you want to go over here where it says create a new product by clicking here so click here and then you can create all of your products so for the summit funnel for example we have three products that we are creating we have the fast action bonus product we have the premium pass bonus product and then we have the evergreen pass product so i'm going to create all three of them at the same time and then link them later on so let me show you how to do that so click on create product over here and then add the name here. Um, it's best to use the name of the product and the funnel as well. So I'm going to call this premium pass. Oh, actually, uh, fast. Fast action bonus is the product and I'm going to add the funnel name that I want it to go into. It doesn't matter, I can use this product in any funnel in the future, but this just helps me with organizing. So I'm gonna put in uh, my storytelling summit whatever the summit name is i'm going to copy this because i'm going to use it again in a moment so i've added in the name you can add a product description if you want to but it's not um, necessary and product type change this to digital pro digital goods um, product image if you would like to create an image for your product you can go ahead and upload file and do that but that is optional uh, pricing uh, name here and to the pricing name here so I'm going to just repeat actually the whole thing down here And then the amount over here, you can select whether it's a one-time or it's a recurring. In this instance, it is a one-time on my account who's already in USD. And I know that this product is $67. So I'm going to click over here on create. And so that first product is created. Now I'm going to click on create product again and create the next product. In this instance for my summit, it's the premium pass. So I'm just going to paste because I'd already copied. And I'm just going to change this to premium pass. So it has a product name and it has the summit name there. Again, just for organization purposes, change this from service to digital goods, upload an image if you want to, it's optional, I don't, so you don't have to unless you want to. Pricing name, I'm going to copy from the top again. Go down, paste it here and change the price to 97 and click on create over here. Now we have two products created now I need one final product created I'm going to click on create product over here and click paste and then just change the name this is my evergreen evergreen pass and again it's the same summit so I'm going to leave that I'm going to skip the product description unless you really want to add one I'm going to change it from service to digital goods I'm going to skip the image unless you really want to add one and I'm going to copy this from the top 
so I can paste it down here at the bottom and I'm going to then add the price uh, which is 147 and I'm going to click on create product over here so now I have these three products created the beautiful thing about this is once you've created these products in this section because of the way that we've just created them you can use them on any funnel right that's the beautiful thing so it's always going to be here and also once you've created these products here you it it's already pre created in a stripe as well which is beautiful so it's now existent in stripe if you did add an image your image would show up here by the way so if you wanted to add an image you can do that um, but for the purpose of demonstration I just haven't done that so your image would show up here now once you've created your product the next thing you want to do is to link your product with the right funnel so in this instance I'm creating a product for my summit funnel now if I was creating this for my um, SLO funnel or for my live event funnel whatever the funnel is I will find that funnel and just link the product in this the same exact way so in this instance um, for the purpose of this I'm doing the summit one so I'm going to click on sites to go back to the funnel I'm already on the funnels page I'm going to find the funnel for the product remember whatever product you're creating just find that specific funnel in this instance it's the summit so I'm going to click on here and then you're going to go to where the product should be so I know that the first product I created was the fast action bonus which is here so I'm going to click here And then I'm going to go back over to products on the right hand side. So I'm going to click on products over here. And then once again, I'm going to click on add product. You can see there's no product here because it hasn't been linked yet. So I'm going to click on add product over here. Now this time, instead of clicking on create new, I'm going to find the product by where it says search for products. I'm going to hit this drop down and voila, can you see that my products are now showing up? So I know that I'm on the fast action bonus step. So I'm going to click on the fast action bonus here brilliant so I've selected that so product name is just literally the same thing that's uh, up there so um, I'm gonna add it here fast action bonus price display override this is optional you don't have to have that let me just check the additional options here no you don't need to put this and this is not a bump product so if you're creating a different type of funnel and you need a bump this will be in this section and i'll have another video for that when we get to that type of funnel but so ignore that so we don't need this price display uh, display override you don't need that because the price has, has already been added when we uh, created the funnel uh, pardon me when we created the product in the first place all you do is click on save so before you hit save here where it says price make sure you hit the drop down and select the product right so all the names should match over here and then you click on save And voila and now we have a product so you can see that it has an id um, it has an amount and it has a type it's a one-time purchase and this is the date that it was created and on the right hand side um, um, here you can click on edit and actually edit this and here um, on this bin you can actually delete this product so now mine says disabled over here the reason it says disabled is because I'm using a demo account and I haven't connected stripe so if you see this it means that you haven't yet connected stripe so you need to go into settings uh, bottom left hand side going to integrations and then connect stripe but if you're following any one of our programs then by now you should already have stripe connected so you shouldn't um, see this disabled icon here if you see it don't worry don't panic all you need to do is to go into settings and connect stripe so i've connected my first product here the next product i want to connect because remember i created three products is my premium pass so i'm going to do the same thing over here on premium pass uh, click on add product and connect that product then once I'm done I'm going to go over to the final step and add the final product in the same way as I added the first one uh, once you're done um, just like we have here you should make sure that in the product um, section here that all of that you have at least a product in the product section that it should be in and finally when you're done the next thing you want to do is go over to publishing click on publishing and just check that you are happy with the uh, funnel step name uh, which should remain the same but most importantly the path over here so this path is called fast action bonus just check that you're happy with it if you're not happy with it change it to something that you are more comfortable with um, but it looks good on my end so I'm just going to leave it there just click on update step and I haven't actually made any changes so that's fine and it's back to overview and so if you are doing a summit funnel or any funnel that has multiple products inside it please make sure that you've added all the products that you need for that specific 
funnel and that you've linked them before moving forward. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Go ahead and click the link below this video and of course get started with Go High Level using my link. Also, I have an amazing masterclass coming up where I walk you through how to turn your courses or coaching programs into a recurring revenue business model without launching, without frustration or without burnout. The link is right below this video. Make sure you click on that and join me for the masterclass. Otherwise, I'll see you on my next video.